Hey guys, Ray Jam. So October fourth at four fifty one. So I've actually been cleaning this whole time, and when I've been cleaning, I've also been eating. So I had my the rest of my apple uh, applesauce, and I also had the deep fried chicken vegan tofu that I made. So I had the rest of it. There's speckles there. So far, they haven't been fighting, so that's good. I'm just trying to get into the bag because there's stuff in it. That's where I put that compost. So, did you guys clean your kitchen? Because I have. And I actually even did, um, I cleaned off the counter, uh, the counter, the cupboard. I took everything off. I moved it, cleaned it down, put it back. Also, did the table, swept and mopped. So it looks good. I just haven't done this side. <laughs> so I'll be another day. It's not that bad. Um, I put sugar in uh, one of the great value coffee things. So that's why I did that. I also cleaned down the oven. <laughs> and people are asking, oh, could you clean my kitchen? How much will it cost? No, I will not clean anybody's kitchen. I better clean my own crap. <laughs> The whole point of this is so that you guys will clean. So hopefully you guys cleaned when I cleaned. So, and if not, later on. But yeah, no. I don't go to people's houses to clean. No matter how much they pay. Especially if they're strangers. And I have no idea where they are. So, please don't leave comments like that. Because obviously, I don't know you. I'm not going to go to your place to, <laughs> to clean. <laughs> You should be coming to my place to clean, but I don't want people to come to my place to clean because usually they do a shitty job, including house cleaners. So, there's speckles there. So that's clear, so now i got to move everything over. And also, um, what was I going to say? Oh, I tried the Maxwell coffee, and it's actually not that bad if I have the sugar Put sugar in the coffee with the coffee creamer. So, <laughs> it's okay, but tomorrow I'm definitely going to get some more great value uh, coffee. So, all these dishes are rinsed. I just got to put them back over to the other shelf. And then I can move the tripod. <clears throat> so, some cleaning tips for you guys. Because one reason why it takes me so long to clean is because I have music on in the background and I take a lot of breaks. I also drink either coffee or water when I clean. I also eat when I clean. So, uh, like I said, I was eating my apples, cinnamon sauce, apples, apple sauce, and then I was cooking the deep fried tofu chicken. Oh, and I also made the tofu and nookie dish. Around here, nothing for you, speckles. Still, gotta do the tofu filling. Yeah, so I made this dish. So, this is one of my favorite dishes. So, whenever I clean, I also cook at the same time. So, then that way I bring something at the same time. Or else I'm cleaning the floors like I just did this side. Uh, another quick advice is take breaks. You don't have to do everything in like less than an hour. Like I go up for smokes and then I usually watch YouTube so watching Arthur. <laughs> I thought that was so funny. There's a, what was it, DW. <laughs> She's she like, oh, we have, I want to know what they did with the lost son because he was wearing glasses. Because he was wearing glasses. Because he didn't, because when, before Arthur never wore glasses till later. I mean, he was trying to explain it to DW, and DW was like, Oh, okay, now I get it, but who's this guy with mom? Which, and it doesn't look like dad. And then Arthur was like, Oh, it looks like it's dad. And she's like, No, it's not, because he has a beard. And then she <laughs> goes to wake them up to ask them. I thought that was pretty funny. But I still love Arthur, so I started watching that again. I'm just going to see if they have it at the library. <laughs> But, unfortunately, I won't be able to work on the classroom today because 
I don't have a yellow sweater, and I don't have blue jeans, so I have to go buy some. So I might go to the thrift store tomorrow if I have time. If not, then sometime on the weekend. But um, they also have a printout, so I shared the link for PBS. They have um, a link so you could print out glasses and the ears so you don't have to make it but I'm going to check dollar, dollar store first if they have anything that's close to it so if I don't have to make it it's better <laughs> and yeah we'll see I mean the McLevin classroom that I made last Halloween it ended up costing me more than the classroom because <laughs> I was trying to find the glasses and then I was trying to find I had to print up a bunch of stuff and then I had to buy a shirt, and even at the thrift store, it was like 20 bucks just for the shirt that I've only worn twice. So, it's like, uh, so yeah, sometimes it's cheaper to just buy the costume. But <clears throat> we'll see how much I get done tomorrow, because like I said, tomorrow's GST, so I have money. But I also spend time with family in the day, in the afternoon. So I'm going to try to go to Metro Town in the morning. And then spend time with my family and then go downtown. Oh, and I am getting the bamboo um, steamers for three bucks. So I'm getting two of them. Haven't heard back about the DVD player yet. Um, and then on the weekend, some point, I have to take speckles in to get his nails done. So we also have to put together the cat carrier and wash it down. Because it's been a while. And I'm still kind of a little nervous about going to the vet because of what happened with Hope. The last time that I took Hope to the vet, I found out that I had to put her down. So it's like, I'm always like worried. That's why I tell them I don't want speckles to be looked at. I just want him to get his nails done if they can. Because my last vet kid. So if they can't do it, then I'll just have to take him there. But the problem with that is that's kind of far. Is like 40 bucks almost in cab cab fares. <laughs> yeah, this place is quicker, uh, what do you call it? Closer. And then I've asked them to, because I told them that, yeah, my cat's an aggressive cat. And they were like, well, we could try. So <laughs> hopefully, because I mean, it's not too hard when there's like two or three people. And hopefully, I'll get that mask for speckles sometime this week still hasn't come in yet because of my heating jacket and i got the mask to put over so he doesn't bite but he could still scratch but then at least if he's wearing that then they just have to worry about the scratching because they're not i mean they might have materials there but kind of want to try it out on him uh, it's pretty heavy but I've, I've been slowly like every other day picking them up so I kind of get used to it uh, so yeah let's uh, put stuff oh and then my USB port wasn't working again it kept saying oh you have to get rid of the water so I used the hair dryer on it because that's what it said and it finally works so that's why I'm charging it so I can't carry move it around <laughs> I'm like what, what's gonna happen if I can't charge it so I don't know why it's doing that, but, um, instead of doing the Arthur costume, we'll be doing the Halloween decorations, because I didn't buy too many, so after I put stuff back to the kitchen, and the kitchen's all done, then we'll do that, and then I'll probably take a nap. <laughs> I don't know if I'll eat, because I'm not really hungry, because I've already been kind of eating, but... You'll see. But yeah, right now I have like all the dishes. I put everything like on the floor. So like I have the dirty dishes on the floor. So I just gotta move them over to the counter. And I have more down here. <laughs> so I was thinking of like recording when I was moving everything and cleaning. And I'm like, you guys have seen it so many times. Uh, hopefully you guys are like cleaning when... But I was cleaning. <laughs> and then, like I said, I was cooking stuff at the same time. So, yeah. 
But, uh, and tomorrow I want to start doing ghost stories every single day to Halloween. So I want to do that tonight. So that's why I got to put up the Halloween decorations before I take a nap. So that's what we're going to do next. And then I'll probably take a nap. <laughs> So right now I'm just moving stuff over. So yeah, if my friend doesn't end up coming from Victoria, then I'm just going to stay home at Halloween and do like a YouTube party kind of thing. I'm not going to hand out candy because it's too expensive and yeah, I'll probably be sleeping when people come by. So, <laughs> you know, because I'm in the basement, people don't really know that I live in the, live in the basement, so... <laughs> Oh yeah, and then I was actually wrong. I thought that my landlord actually built this place, but it wasn't. They actually bought it from somebody who built the place. So that's why there's photos. There's like thing the star and the moon and stuff. And there's speckles. Are you gonna let me look? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> See, he's getting better at it. Hey, speckles. But at least they're not fighting anymore, so I guess they just, I don't know why they were fighting. I guess uh, Josephine wanted to be on the bed, and Sreckles was on the bed, and he's like, this is my spot, so get away. <laughs> but it all happened when I was sleeping, so. I'm still pretty tired because they were fighting all night. It's like, oh, so much noise. I'm so glad I never wanted kids. <laughs> So these are all rinsed now, and like I said, I already cleaned down the oven. Also, <coughs> you guys are doing the five traps like I am. Remember to keep dumping it out and filling it up again with soap, apple cider, vinegar, and water, and you'll see I'm coming because even though it's cold, there's there's still tons of them. Even mosquitoes. There was a mosquito a few nights ago when I was watching TV and I killed it. <laughs> so, but it was frustrating me because I'm allergic. So, there's still bugs even in the winter. And like the mosquito bracelets, I always wear them and I wasn't wearing it. And then I got a bite. I was like, oh. So, I may, I may have to get some more bracelets even though it's winter. But they keep coming inside. Same with the fruit flies. I know everybody has fruit flies right now. So I'm going to put this back. I did all the cat dishes. Ugh. Well, not all. I did at least a... Um, load. <laughs> And there's also a bag behind the chair where I'm putting, like, the dishes that I want to give away to hope to SPCA. So hopefully by next week, I'll have a bunch of stuff. I'm also planning tonight to go through the cat toys in the other room. So I could get rid of a bunch and I don't, and the blue litter box that's standing on the side. That's also going to go to uh, SBCA because, like I said, they paid to uh, put Hope down, and that would have cost me $250, so minimum. There's different choices, and I also got to send them a letter, <laughs> a letter and a photo as well, so I'm hoping to do that tonight because... Um, yeah, I know people who work there, so they could just drop it off and do, like, a photo. So I wanted to do one for the vet and one for the SBCA, telling them thank you. Even though it's been so long now, I don't even know <coughs> when that happened off my off my head, but it's on my YouTube when Hope passed away. It's been a couple of months now. 
So, I don't know if they have that on file, like the receipt or anything. But, uh, for blood work, because the cat stood up on it, so now I don't have a copy. I still have to claim that to disability. So, I'm going to try to go to the welfare office uh, sometime next week. And then when I go there, I'm going to talk to them about getting my dental done. I still have to get my glasses done, but the place where I used to do my glasses is going to get them for free. No longer around. <laughs> still have to get my hearing thing t uh, done and get he new hearing aids, even though I don't use them, just for a backup. So I got to call them tomorrow. Um, I called the asthma place, but I haven't heard back from them, so I'll call them again tomorrow. That's why I wanted to call the ministry today, but I'm like, I, I gotta clean. I don't want to be on hold for like four hours when I can be listening to music. <laughs> so, I'm just going to go there and talk to them and ask them everything all at, all at once. Sometime next week, since I have money. Because I hate going out when I have money. It's far. It's like... Kingsway and something. So I got at least uh, two bus rides. <laughs> so it's like, yeah, if I'm going to go, I want to make sure I have money so I can buy coffee and food when I'm out and do other things. So, yeah, because my teeth are really starting to bother me. I have to get the... I think, I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly that he was saying that that's a cavity, but it's like a molar kind of thing, so... <clears throat> That's why it costs so much money, but then I'm just wondering if they could pull it out rather than keep doing stuff for Because <laughs> it's just one tooth and it's like down here, so one of the baby teeth. Like if I could just get it pulled out, I'd rather have it pulled out than having to keep going back. Because that's what happened with the, my top teeth because they're partial. So, um... Because they weren't fully developed. Now to keep getting a root canal done over and over and over again. Like every four months almost. And I was like, it's so freaking painful. Can you just pull it out? And he's like, well, we don't really want to pull your teeth. I'm like, well, I just want it pulled out. Because it's too painful to keep going back over and over again. And this was before I had conditions. So then they said, okay, we'll try. So then... That's when they start pulling out my teeth, but then, because I passed out, they can't finish it. And they don't want to finish it. They just want to give me partial dentures, so. I guess in a way it's better, because, like, all my bottom teeth are still all my baby teeth. And they don't hurt. And, like, I don't really, the only time when I have my teeth in is, like, when I go out or when I'm on camera. <laughs> Sometimes when I'm not on camera. But... Yeah, just because my dentist keeps telling me i got to wear them more often. But they're just so uncomfortable. So yeah, if you guys don't want to see them, don't watch. But I'll show you guys again. Because there's wires on this side. So these two are real. And these are real. But these aren't real. And because of the wires, they are very uncomfortable. But it's the only way it stays in. And then, they're just very uncomfortable to have in all the time. So I don't have them in all the time, like most seniors. <laughs> so my mom has dentures too, so it's like, it's so annoying. I'd rather just not wear them. Because they're actually supposed to help you to chew, but for me, they don't. <laughs> So, yeah, and I, keep, I can't have corn or anything like that. But anyways, let's continue on with the cleaning list so we can do the Halloween decorations. I remember I was born this way. My teeth weren't fully developed, so I, I've never had all my teeth. But sometimes I go to kids and pretend. I tell them, yeah, if you guys don't wash, uh, <clears throat> brush your teeth and floss your teeth, you're going to lose your teeth like mine. <laughs> As a joke. And then I explained to them, no, I was actually not fully developed. 
because I was a premature surviving triplet. So I've got the cups. But I am starting to get tired. Like I usually say, it's around five or six that I'm tired. I didn't sleep too much, too well last night, so right now I'm over to move it here. But I try to like at least put all the plates together. Oops. <laughs> so like I have all the plates and then the containers, they're already rinsed. I did most of the plates. And then And then push this. So I also cleaned down on both sides of the counter uh, with the apple cider vinegar thing and cleaning the solution so I didn't film that because you guys have seen that so many times. <laughs> I was thinking, hmm, save, save it for you guys, but I ended up cooking and eating. So now I'm not hungry because I already ate. So this is the finished product. The bag I gotta put back in the fridge because it's the compost. Or I mean I throw the stuff in the compost so it's pretty clean. Now it's to put the dishes in the sink. <laughs> but I'll do that I'll do that later. Those are soaking. And there's containers. And then the floors. This whole side of the floor is done. I swept and mopped and moved that. I moved the cupboard there. The oven I did, so I'm not going to do it again. And yeah, lots. It took four hours because, like I said, I took a lot of breaks. <laughs> so the best things to do when you clean is take a lot of breaks, drink a lot of water, and coffee or whatever helps to make you stay awake. I have music on in the background, and just take your time. Don't don't rush. So that's why I'm like, well, I've already done one thing today, so that's good enough. And yeah, so I was going to do the other side of the kitchen, but I've already done that a few days ago, and I kind of just do like a quick, quick, uh, quick sleep. <laughs> so... Now, I'm going to <clears throat> feed the cats and upload this video while I feed the cats. And then we're going to uh, put up the Halloween decorations and then I'll take a shower and a nap. So, stay tuned for more. But at least I get one thing done today with you guys that I said that I was going to do. Unfortunately, Arthur's going to have to wait because... I gotta go buy stuff for it, <laughs> and I'll get paid till tomorrow, so. Yeah, unfortunately I can't work on the costume, but at least we could start on the Halloween decorations, because as soon as I wake up, I want to record a ghost story for tomorrow. I'd put it up, and also an intro, or at least have it ready to go, so then that way when I wake up, uh, most likely I'll have it up the ghost story at like just after midnight if we end up if I don't end up sleeping all night <laughs> all night so yeah um anyways stay tuned for that I love Halloween so if you guys have to uh decorate you could decorate with me I just got a few decorations not too many so yeah, like, comment, share, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys uh, right after I feed the cats. Go for a smoke, and we're going to put up the Halloween decorations here on Phantom Stories.